This is the demo section for the Midnight Attack Lab. In the lab, we have three computers. X-Terminal, the attacker computer, and the trust computer. So we are using Dr. Compose to create them. So first, we will log in the X terminal first. And we're creating the R host file. So we will echo the IP of the, the computer, the trusted computer, into this so that it will automatically authenticate and connect between the, the two computers. So the two computers are connected. So now we log in into the C attacker's computer. So we open the white shot first and then we we will run the midnight spoof code. So this is the, the midnight spoof code. And when the code runs it will bring out 
some uh, value. And as you can see, that means it's working. And let's check the white shot. So we uh, we have a three-way access here, the TCB. Uh, here, which man is working and we need to get the sequence the sequence number so to do that we open this and we will take this number next we will open the Mitnick ACK file And so then we change the ACK. We change the ACK into the sequence number of the first of the first step, uh, as you can see here. So basically, the sequence we transform into the ACK, and the ACK will be swapped into the sequence. And if we do one more time and swap into the step three, so we're using the sequence number of the first step into the ACK of the second step. Now we will run the code. As you can see, here is the data, and the command touch tmpxyz has been added. And our our session is successfully established. As you can see here, this is the code, the data we added. And next, we're going to run another code. Let's see in ACK. And now, as I said before, the ACK in the last step will be the sequence in the third step. And now we're going to change it. And so we have a new port here, 9090. And if we run it successfully, we see a port 9090. Now we check the wash up. Now we have the port 9090. Now we will open the X terminal container. And we will look for the XYZ file that the touch the touch command added. As you can see, the XYZ file is available. Now to set up the back door, we will log in the C attacker container. And we will look for the Midnick ACK PY file. Before that, it was touch, TMP, XYZ, and that command was meant to create the XYZ file. And now we change to echo plus plus, and I host to add 
the two plus into the R house file. Now we will run Mitnick ACK one more time. And as you can see, the echo R house has been added. And we have done setting up the back door. And this is the end of this demo. Thank you.